Oh, uh, Black Sabbath. Black Sabbath. Do you want to sponsor us? Ooh. Uh, Fahrenheit, I miss you too. We might be able to hold a possible game on. We don't One know. Day. One day. One day. Hopefully soon. Hopefully soon. So if if that does happen, I'll be sure to let you know. Yeah. So we can all have the awesome reunion. <laughs> that would be pretty tight. Oh, oh. Boy. Okay. Did you, oh, he's playing one PT into another PT, and I'm wondering how this is going to affect him, because, like, I know, like, a lot of the time you expect habits to come from, like, the same Pokemon trainer, but it's so different, just, like, so, like, uh, I know Hamza used to play Roy, and, like, our Roys are completely different, and, yeah. like, going from, like, his Roy to my Roy, it just throws you off, so, Humza's like... very methodical, and you're a lot more aggressive. I'm willing. I'm much more willing than him, <laughs> yeah. in that sense. Hamza's very about, like, safe, proper play, yeah. proper space, and stuff like that, and you're like, hey, what if I killed you? The... Be the <laughs> the best way how I could describe it is that uh, Hamza plays Krom while I play Roy. I mean, yes. Whoa. Whoa. That was really... See, like, he's willing to go for that. But, so, the thing with edge guarding is a lot of the time people are willing to go for those singular hits. But, like, I feel like... Um, so, like, both... Um, Cloud X, like, let's say Cloud X by left. He'll yeah. go a lot of time off stage with like a down air or like a forward air. But like one thing that he can do is like run off with a neutral air. I completely agree. Because like it's, oh, he rolled under that. But um, that he was, bro, uh, just block. Yeah. <laughs> But he can uh he can go for like um, a neutral off, off stage because like it's a longer lasting hitbox and there's a chance to send the opponent away. Yeah. Could semi spike as well. Yeah, if you trade, you can get some weird semi spikes. Yeah, and there's like unlike with Charizard as well, like instead of going for like a back air which has like a small hitbox but can kill, you can just gimp with a nair. And it lasts way longer. So yeah. like a lot of the time it's like if you have the option to actually like. Like, like, let's say you have, like, Link Snare. If you have it, you're just going to use it all the time. And yeah. despite not having that exact tool, the similarity is still striking. Yeah. And what's striking right now yeah, is Eagles. When I was more on the ball with Lucas, and when I was playing more actively, one of my favorite edgeguards would just be run off down air. Yeah. It, it's such a long-lasting hitbox, and it does spike. Yeah, which, exactly. it's, and it's also pretty cool. Yeah. It's a cool move. All right. Oh, okay, the okay. multi-hit coming out from Cladex. So, one thing oh, that... If he held it, that would have been... Yeah, that's all. <laughs> that's it. Oh... Actually gonna catch some coaching charges for this. <laughs> this is unreal. When, uh, one thing that I told CloudX to do recently is like... So, like Roy, a lot of things I do is um, I like to drop down, as I like to do a full hop, landing like uh, side B. Yeah. It's a, it's, it has a lot of risk and reward because like if it hits, it kills. But if it misses, you can literally punish with anything you want. But the thing is like it's a multi hit and no one's expecting that from like a full on aerial approach. They're expecting yeah. like to parry a singular hit. So it's worth it sometimes to go for it, but that's what's not worth it is. Oh, Ooh, chaos dunk. No uh, chaos dunk. I like the idea though. I mean, Kyogre could have gone for a. Let's <laughs> see with silence. Here we went for a down air again. You know, it's kind of unlikely for him to do that, actually. Oh. <gasps> Oh, that, that killed you. Would have been cool, but now you look a little bit silly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's battlefield. What? It's very upsetting. But what can you do? So nice roll okay. behind forward tilt, and he's going for the back air again. And again, I like these high tether recoveries. They're keeping a lot of people out of kind of those danger zones right below the ledge. Yeah, exactly. Oh, up air. Oh, oh, he has two mul two double jumps, yeah. so he's fine. But now he doesn't have anything. All right. That's gotta be it. Drops the punish, come on! That's the third time he's... This is the first time... Whoa. Okay, so I know he did it against uh, Eagle where he dropped the punish, but now he also did it against Kyogre, and I yeah. think that's just unfamiliar here. Shot through the heart, and you're to blame? Yeah. Shot to the heart. You can love a bad name? Nice shot, nice shot. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh my goodness. Alright, so Cloud X is currently up a game. After yeah. facing one PT, he fights another. <laughs> this is the gauntlet. In uh, in Guilty Gear, Look, I'm in a server that runs if... periodically, and Potemkin is very popular. Yeah. First of all, evil character. Yes. But playing three Potemkins in a row, <laughs> they're all stylistically different, is yes. the hardest thing I've ever done. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did Kyogre just go in Sinner? Oh, I mean, he is, the, he, he is the Pokemon trainer, so he he should be a master with all the Pokemon. Do you have a license for that in Sinner? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you you sign up for a turtle. Uh, you sign up for a turtle, a lizard, 
and was that a weird insect but now you have a giant cat so yeah. i don't know if you have the license for that this is like hofstra's pet rules it's like yeah i see you have a five gallon yeah. tank for a goldfish that appears to be an alligator everybody in hofstra appears to have some sort of uh big big the cat going on yeah well, except yeah. me so i got to join in on that yeah exactly maybe you're the one who's missing out it's it's a fire it's a fire type too in roy's fire so hold I could be, on fire hazard i could be yeah i could be the fire boys <laughs> No, the fire marshal would never let this slide. <laughs> I'll get fined, unfortunately. Yeah, so I, I will say, personally, I think Pokemon Trainer might have been the better pick. I definitely do think that, but I feel like Kyogi feels that, uh, oh. Whoa. Whoa. He doesn't have jump, yeah. yeah interesting uh, I feel like Kyogre believes that, like, um, Cladix has too much experience against, um, it's kind of like throwing, it's kind of just like throwing a... So, the way how I think of myself when I play is that, like, we're throwing, I'm sorry, we're throwing two footballs at each other, right? And we're trying to get the other person to, uh, to miss the football or to hit the person with the football, right? But we're too good at catching because we're too experienced. So, what I do to make you get hit is that I will throw a dodgeball at you. And right. so, the thing is, like, a dodgeball, it's slower, it's bigger, and way easier to avoid and grab or catch, but you're not expecting the dodgeball. Yeah. So, it's like, well, you know, in theory, you sh if you catch a football, you should be able to catch a dodgeball. This is more like just intentionally throwing weirdly. And yeah. Like, okay, but they can still catch it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's like, when? It's it's such a better it's such a better matchup for Byleth, I believe, but then it's like, oh, that was a really good idea for a counter because yeah. he definitely would have suffered. Yeah, that, oh, yeah. I like the idea. He's active yeah. enough to get through that. I, I think the other side of it, and this is maybe the Guilty Gear background. Oh, thing, wow. But in Guilty Gear, you don't counterpick. It's extremely rare. Yeah, really? Yeah. It's, I've seen a successful counterpick once in my life. That's interesting. Yeah, so to me, my mindset is always, you know, I'd rather just fight it with the character I know best. Just dig down and hope that it works. Yeah, exactly. I, not, when I was playing against Kawasaki, I was actually going to go Dark Samus. <laughs> then I was like, I was like, you know what? I'm just going to, I'm just going to stick it with Roy. And it worked only because Kawasaki was kind enough to help me out in that third game. <laughs> Listen, it happens. It, it, uh, we take those, yeah, uh, no. as sad as it is, but uh, he definitely, I think he should have won that set, but it is what yeah. it is. Oh, nice so Cladex is really good at juggling and, use, and using that up air. And also, one more thing that he's recently started doing, against B specifically, is that he's waited for my air dodges to get back. <gasps> wow. All right. Oh, just wait. I did not realize that had so much knockback. Yeah, it, it's a really strong move. Violet is, is pretty much like the the... Dis the disjoint Ganondorf, yeah. if you will.